we are continuing the chemical reaction i took four basic types of chemical reaction one combination reaction which we did in previous class this is second decomposition reaction we are doing now and another class we'll do displacement reaction and next we'll be doing this acid base reaction there are four basic types of chemical reaction we are going to write and balance the equation here decomposition reaction means what when a compound splits up into two or more than two uh, elements or other compounds then the chemical reaction is called decomposition reaction and uh, we are writing some we are taking some example of this decomposition reaction look at this potassium chlorate when it is split off or when it decomposes then we'll get potassium chloride potassium chloride and oxygen gas if you remember it is taught in lower class that uh, in the laboratory when potassium chloride is heated at high temperature then it decomposes to potassium chloride and oxygen gas this is the laboratory preparation method of oxygen gas by heating process now this is complete word equation but we are writing balanced chemical equation now how to convert it into balanced chemical equation okay, this potassium is written as k and chlorate means what clo3 this is a compound potassium balance you one chlorate balance you one equal balance in no exchange now, now what it gives potassium chloride potassium k chloride means cl now potassium balance you one chlorine balance you one equal balance in no exchange but oxygen we are not writing o we have to write o2 why i told you in previous class also i want to recall again hydrogen oxygen nitrogen fluorine chlorine bromine and iodine they are diatomic element these elements whenever wherever becomes free they always lie in this form hydrogen shares to uh, uh, hydrogen shares electron and aps as s2 oxygen shares electron with each other and two oxygen atom comes together in the chemical reaction these are all diatomic but other elements are monoatomic that's why if we have to write them then we'll write O2, N2, F2, S2, etc. If we have to write just uh, other elements like iron, mercury, etc., we write Fe, Hg, etc. They are monoatomic. Now, the balance, balancing this equation, how can we balance? Oxygen 2, oxygen 3, this is odd, this is even. I suggest you to convert odd into even by taking 2 here, 3, 2, just 6. Here it is 2 only, 3, 2, just 6 is balanced. Now, stone of chlorine. Chlorine 1, chlorine here, it is 2. That's why if we take here 2, then chlorine is balanced. Now, stone of potassium, potassium 2, potassium 2, balance. This is balanced chemical equation of this word equation. Now, let's talk about the another one. Water, when decomposes, after the electrolysis process, we know that water decomposes into hydrogen, hydrogen and oxygen gas this is word equation completed now what is uh, is a balanced chemical equation water we know as 2o and hydrogen this is diatomic as 2 oxygen it is also diatomic we have to write o2 now it's turn to balance the equation oxygen 2 oxygen here 1 that's why we have to take here 2 2 2 equal hydrogen here right hand side 2 left hand side it is 4 that's why if we take here 2 it's balanced this is the balanced chemical equation of electrolysis of water okay hydrogen peroxide when decomposes if you remember this is non-heating method of preparation of oxygen gas in laboratory we use hydrogen peroxide to get oxygen by non-heating method in this reaction hydrogen peroxide decomposes into water and oxygen gas 
This is unstable compound which decomposes into water and oxygen gas. Hydrogen peroxide, we, we remember this um, molecular formula S2O2. I told you, you in previous class here, a valency exchange is not correct because it's unstable compound. S2O2 for hydrogen peroxide. When it decomposes, it forms water, S2O, and oxygen. Oxygen is diatomic, O2. Now, how to balance oxygen 2? And here also oxygen 3. In left hand side it is 2 only. Right hand side it is odd. But this is even this one only odd. That's why I want to take here 2. 2 plus 2 4. And if I took here. If I take here 2. Then 2 2 is a 4. Oxygen balanced. 2 2 is a 4. Hydrogen also balanced. This way it is balanced. Now calcium carbonate is also called limestone. In the industrial method of preparation of carbon dioxide gas. This calcium carbonate is heated at high temperature and it decomposes to calcium oxide. Calcium oxide and carbon dioxide gas. And carbon dioxide gas. Now, this is the word equation, complete word equation. Now, how to convert it into balanced chemical equation? Calcium carbonate, calcium Ca, carbonate CO3, valency of calcium 2, carbonate 2 equal valency, no exchange. Now, calcium oxide, Ca, calcium oxide means O, oxygen is combined, valency 2, 2, no exchange, plus carbon dioxide, we know, CO2. Now, look, look at these uh, numbers, 2 plus 1, 3, in right hand side it is 3, and left hand side also 3, carbon 1, carbon 1 is balanced, oxygen already to, uh, seen, calcium 1, calcium 1, this is balanced chemical equation. Okay, now we don't have to take any number, it is already balanced. Silver bromide, when silver bromide decomposes, these two elements separate from each other that is silver and bromine now how to write balanced chemical equation silver ag bromide means bromine is combined valency one one equal valency no exchange now when silver comes out silver ag this is not diatomic this only are diatomic. I, again, I want to make you clear that this one only, these are only diatomic. Ag, just Ag plus bromine. Br2, this is diatomic. Okay. Now, balance the equation. Bromine 2, bromine 1. If we take here 2, bromine balance. Silver 1, silver 2. If we take here 2, then it is balanced. Okay. Now, next, let's talk about this. Mercuric oxide. Mercury and oxygen is combined. Then, when it is heated at high temperature, mercury and oxygen separate. Mercury and oxygen separate from each other. Mercuric, ik means valency 2. Os means valency 1. Metal uh, are uh, represented by is and ik and os. Os means less valency of that metal, it means more valency of that metal. Mercury has two different valency, one and two, and it represents two, os represents one. Here it is two. Mercuric means HZ is combined with oxygen. At this time, valency is two. Mercury, valency two, oxygen, valency two, equal valency, no exchange. When it decomposes, then, then we will write mercury hg plus oxygen o2 this is monoatomic this is diatomic that's why oxygen 2 oxygen 1 if we take here 2 oxygen balance mercury 1 mercury 2 if we take here 2 mercury also balance these are few example of decomposition reaction it is a reaction in which a compound splits up into two or more than two elements or other compounds now next class i'll continue with displacement reaction